Okay, so this is a small block Chevy here at 350. We're gonna do the hydraulic valve setting. There's two sets of valves. There's a hydraulic and a mechanical type for the firing order for this is actually one, eight, four, three, six, five, seven, two. So when cylinder one is firing, you can set corresponding cylinder six. When cylinder eight is firing, you can set corresponding cylinder five. In order to find top dead center for your cylinders, you need to grab your pulley and turn the motor over clockwise until your intake is opening a slight amount and your exhaust is closing or the opposite nonetheless you can see them both moving yeah then you can go over to cylinder six and you take your push rod and spin it in your hand while tightening the nut down you need to be able to have a small amount of tension on it but still be able to spin it and then you take your wrench or your socket and tighten the bolt another half turn and your valves are set and we can fire it up Okay, so while we were turning the engine over, we did prime the, uh, the engine. We're a diesel shop, so we don't really have the right tools. What you want to do is take an old distributor and stick it in the hole, cut the top off, and put your drill on it. Um, we just took a screwdriver and, and uh, an old crappy screwdriver and put a socket over top and crank it over. But you won't get oil pressure to the one bank because your oil pressure runs through a valley at the back goes around your distributor and it's your distributor that actually feeds the right hand side. So we can throw the distributor in now, throw the valve covers on, um, start running some fuel lines over and then uh, I think it's just about ready to throw in the truck. So here we go. Hey, hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you love the channel, consider picking up a tape boss to make those projects go faster so you got more time to watch YouTube. And remember, if you're not filthy, you're not rich.